Welcome to my garage and my very broken Mazda Speed 3. So, um, let me grab a, me grab a wrench real quick. I'm trying to find which one it was. Ah, okay. So, it's this camshaft that is loose and this one's fine this one's fine um but if you pay attention to um this bolt right here uh i'm turning it boy that's the wrong size so i'm gonna turn it and the gears don't move look at the bolt turning However, I can take the uh, intake and it works. And you can see the slack. You can see the slack. That is not look good. It's just, look how easy. That is not good at all. So I really wanted to time it. And I bought a bunch of stuff for it. I bought a timing key. It's right there. And my bolts are laying around. Um, and then I took it to... So basically, I have to take this whole side panel off. It runs down the side there, and uh, this engine mount's kind of toast, but I'll get a new one for that, and you don't have to worry about that. Um, so I took off the wheel to get to the uh, crankshaft, and I had turned it. I don't have uh, another way to show you. I can't show you right now because I can't turn it, and then also show the uh, chain. But when I turn it, um, the chain does not move at all. So. I really think there's an issue here. Um, like I've turned it all the way around and it doesn't seem to work at all. Uh, that's pretty much it. Um, really like to get some kind of, at least a ballpark estimate for you guys to tell me uh, how much it'd be to uh, fix this issue. Also, um, I think it'd be a lot easier for you guys to take the engine completely out because I did need some new pistons. I was going to get the uh, Manly Platinum Series um, and bore it out just a little bit uh, just so it'd get that new engine feel. Um, and when you do that, you have to retime it anyway. So, um, so I need like gaskets, um, maybe a new VVT kit, and then uh, pistons. I'm not sure how it works if I bring in my own pistons and let you guys use them. I was told that would be against warranty. Like they wouldn't be there wouldn't be a warranty if I did that. So. Um, I guess I could tell you guys which part to buy. Uh, that's that's pretty much it. That's that's the deal we've got going right now. Uh, there aren't any other known engines I have with the car. Um, if you're gonna ask me how it happened, uh, I was driving and then the uh, engine stalled, and it gave me an error. Uh, I have an access port, but it's right here, and it gave me the error, and it was like. P0340 P0340 and it was a camshaft timing issue it was not the sensor I tested the sensor with a uh, where'd it go anyway um, sensor is somewhere but I was going to put everything in bags and label them and tell you guys where everything went that way it'd be easier you wouldn't have to dis disassemble as much um, but yeah, that's that's pretty much it. I'd like to get at least a ballpark estimate of how much it would cost to um, just one thing at a time, I guess, repair the timing and then maybe the timing and the pistons together. Uh, see how much that would cost, how long it would be. Uh, yeah, that's that's pretty much it. Thank you.